Lovecraft Country heartthrob Jonathan Majors has emerged as the latest smoldering cover star of Men's Health. The 33-year-old showcased his chiseled beefcake physique, flexing his astonishing muscles as he posed shirtless on the cover. He wore nothing but a tiny pair of shorts as he rose up out of a swimming pool, shooting his best supermodel stare at the camera for the magazine. Jonathan's shoot for the inside of the magazine showed him engaged in athletic activities including one of him dangling upside down from a set of pull-up bars. The Hollywood hunk, who has two Belgian Malinois called Captain and Hero, appeared in a charming snap with one of his dogs perched across his shoulders. He frolicked around the kitchen as well, where he was pictured frying an egg and chugging a smoothie straight from the blender. Making his way around the kitchen shirtless in a pair of what looked like swim drunks, he playfully juggled a few oranges. Jonathan takes a relaxed attitude to being a sex symbol, a status that increased this spring when a shirtless picture of him leaked from the set of Creed 3. Now I kind of step away from that part. There's nothing wrong with that. I embrace it. I also mostly wear hoodies when I'm out. I stay covered up, he told Men's Health. I think that's part of being sexy. I'm not conscious of it. My brother was the pretty boy. I was never the cute boy growing up. I was just Jay Jonathan, the father of a nine-year-old little girl was tight-lipped about his personal life and declined to reveal whether he is involved with anyone at the moment. He did shed light on his peripatetic lifestyle, dishing to the magazine, I've been without a permanent physical address for six years now, without rent or mortgage and never in one place for longer than three to five months. The California-born actor, who shot to fame in the indie movie The Last Black Man in San Francisco, also revealed his abiding confidence. His sense of self is undisturbed by people telling me you're not smart enough or you're not handsome enough or you're not talented enough. And I go, oh, but I know I am. And not because my ego tells me I am but because I'm ready. Jonathan spilled, I haven't had a carb in two and a half months. I know I can take my shirt off. I've been running miles. And because I've failed. I've already had another grown man pull the weight off my chest because everything has died. I've already tried to jump on the horse and broke my heel. This is not going to be worse. At the moment he is awaiting the release of his upcoming movie Devotion, a war film that bows in theaters November 23rd. Devotion stars Glenn Powell as Lou Hudner and Jonathan as his wingman and pal Jesse Brown serving as fighter pilots during the Korean War. During the Battle of Chosin Reservoir Jesse was shot down by the Chinese, prompting Lou to crash land his own plane to try and save him. Jesse died in the wreckage of his plane in spite of his friends' attempts but Lou was still awarded the Medal of Honor for his bravery in the battle. Because Jesse was black he also dealt with racial discrimination in the U.S. Navy which was still segregated when he began to serve, 